Welcome to this demo showcasing Microsoft SharePoint Blob Storage Management enabled by Metalogic Storage Point and protected by EMC Replication Manager. This video is one in a series as part of this EMC proven solution. The content will be going through the architecture design and then a video of Metalogic's installation. We have the SharePoint farm with content database of 4.3 terabyte in total on block tiered storage. There's also a 1 terabyte file share on a file tier storage. Metalogic storage point is installed and configured in the SharePoint farm. The SharePoint blobs are then externalized with Metalogic storage point. They externalized to a lower tier of storage. We then show that the SharePoint content databases are shrunk, thus freeing up space on the higher tier of storage. The one terabyte file share is migrated into SharePoint, which results in the metadata in SharePoint increasing slightly due to this added content. EMC Replication Manager is introduced to protect the block and the file SharePoint content. SnapView protects the block content and SnapSure protects the file content. You can now watch a short video with this how we show how Metalogic's storage point installs seamlessly into SharePoint. We run the executable, but the dashboard comes up and we select the run storage point install option. We follow the steps. The first step is that the install goes and checks to see if the system is suitable to install. We progress on to accept the conditions. It then asks us for a license key. We put that in and provide the local admin credentials for the farm servers. We test a connection to the database and then it gives us the option to test authentication. It then goes and creates the database. We show an example of where we can see the storage point database being created. We go back to the install, check the progress, and there's a reminder to restart the IIS and SharePoint timer services on all WFEs. When it's completed successfully, we get the screen showing so. We now go to Central Admin and there we can see Storage Point has been added from where we can manage our SharePoint content and in our case we're going to do RBS. Thank you for watching this video with us. There are more videos that are part of the solution, please watch them as well as you can download the white paper from the link below.